Okay, so this is my latest little aquarium project. I just did a five gallon one by Fluval, which is really nice. I just sort of retired it, had it for several years. It was very, very successful. Um, but it just turned out uh, the my beta that I had, my, my kitty got my beta and sort of took the wind out of my sails. And um, so I decided to just start again, but with an even smaller tank, a 2.5 gallon. Now they say that the smaller the tank it is, the more challenging they are, and that's okay. Um, I like a good challenge. So I got this little Topfin tank for 50 bucks, um, and it's a fantastic little thing. I love it. It's just, I got the little glass lid on the top and a little light bar and so on. There's the culprit right there who ate my beta. Dusty, she ate my beta, harpooned her right out of the... Corey, I'm the other one. Anyway, so, and I'm going to use this Tropica plant growth system because I've had a lot of success with it. It's a portable sort of thing. It's very reasonably priced. It's inexpensive, really, especially with a small tank like this. Like these canisters will last you three to four months, and they're like 25 bucks for three of them or whatever. So, you know, that's pretty good. And if you use this properly and go according to... Uh, the Tropica system, and it's not really a plug for Tropica, but I really like their system. It's really good. Um, and then use their substrate. Um, now you can have really good results. Anyway, so this is my latest project. Um, I'm going to see how it goes. I'm looking forward to it, and I'm going to use CO2 again, because CO2 is the only way to really keep algae under control and to have your plants flourish as nice as they do. Uh, okay, so we'll see how she goes.